Hello, my name is Megan Davis, and I'm a research professor in aquaculture and stock enhancement at Florida Atlantic University, Harbor Branch Oceanographic Institute. Today, I will be presenting eConk, e-learning for growing queen conch. We have an international team of co-authors and collaborators who I wanna thank very much for being part of this presentation and also thank very much for participating in this project. We have co-authors from across the United States, from including Puerto Rico, also from the Bahamas, Curacao, Trinidad, Jamaica, Antigua, St. Eustatius, Belize, and Italy. The Queen Conch is the most significant molluscan fishery in the Caribbean, with many island communities depending on it for sustenance and their livelihoods. It is harvested for its meat and prized for its unique pink shell. Additionally, the Queen Conch plays a dynamic ecological role as a keystone grazing herbivore, keeping seagrass beds clean and healthy. Unfortunately, over the decades, fishing pressure and habitat loss have led to population declines across the conch geographic range. I'd like to introduce you to the Queen Conch Lab, which is at Florida Atlantic University Harbor Branch. It's led by myself and my great team. I have more than 40 years of experience farming Queen Conch and working with communities that depend on the species. The Queen Conch Lab's mission is to grow the Queen Conch for the sake of the species, the ecosystem, and the people who depend on the fishery. Our vision is for there to be a Queen Conch farm in every Caribbean nation. The Queen Conch Lab aims to protect the conch's future through a combination of conservation, aquaculture, research, and education. And we collaborate with international partners to conserve the Queen Kong and to support the fishers. We have received and continue to receive many requests for Queen Kong information, for training and assistance with designing and installing and supporting small Queen Kong aquaculture facilities. In response to these requests, Econc was established in May 2020 with input from a team of partners and advisors, many of who are co-authors of this presentation. Econc is an online course that's being developed to teach the basic skills necessary to grow Queen Conch for restoration, conservation education, and sustainable seafood. Our team's goal is to create a well-tested course that can be offered widely across the Caribbean to interested individuals spreading this knowledge in an efficient way. The Queen Conch Lab is partnering with Florida Atlantic University Center for Online Learning and Continuing Education. We are building the e-course, the e-conch course modules in a Canvas platform. As part of the hands-on portion of the course, the participants can use a kit for a bench top type of hatchery or use an existing hatchery. Participants can also choose to take the online course only. Econ will consist of eight modules. Participants will learn about the Queen Conch life cycle, aquaculture best practices, how to design and set up conch aquaculture system, how to raise Queen Conch from the egg mass to the juvenile stage, and how to feed the conch throughout its life cycle. They will also learn about some options that exist for restoration and ranching for food. The primary text for the econ course is the Queen Conch Aquaculture Manual, prepared by Megan Davis, myself, and Victoria Kassar. It's published in the Journal of Shellfish Research in December 2020, and it is available online with open access. The manual will be supplemented with instructional videos, presentations, practical activities, and discussions to ensure that course objectives are met. 
All the technology will be simple to use and the course will be structured with schedule flexibility in mind to accommodate busy working participants. The tech support will be available through FAU Center for Online Learning and Continuing Education and subject matter experts from the Queen Conk Lab will be available to answer questions. A Spanish version of the manual is due to be released by FAO by early December with the authors including myself, Victoria Casar, Raimunda Espinoza, Alessandro Lavatelli. In addition to the manuals, we will also have videos. And so in July, 2021, Timber and Frame came and visited our NOAA fisheries supported Puerto Rico conch hatchery, and they filmed footage showing many of the processes to grow conch. We're now in the process of working with Timber and Frame on post-production to produce five short videos in English. We're also planning that these videos will have subtitles in Spanish, French, and Dutch. And here you can see a list of the five videos. I also want to mention to you that there are a few pilot queen conch hatcheries currently in progress in the Caribbean. These are being used to help design and test course materials. They are located in Puerto Rico, as I've already mentioned. There's also a working queen conch hatchery in Curacao, and a MOVA hatchery is being built at Harbor Branch for the Bahamas. Many instructional photos and videos for the econ course have been created in partnership with the Puerto Rico Queen Kong Hatchery. Econ, this online learning course that we've been discussing, will first be tested by our Caribbean beta test site partners, which include our co-authors on this presentation. These groups will provide the feedback and help improve the course before it's offered to a wider audience. Here you can see a map of our beta test site partners. And it is anticipated that we will begin testing the econ in the summer of 2022. The transfer of technology and information to Caribbean communities via the econ will benefit the species, the ecosystem, and the communities that depend on the fishery. We found that learning through aquaculture leads to awareness of the life cycle of the species, which in turn can make and help make the community members better stewards of their resources and managers of their fishery. If you're interested in learning more about the econ program and the work that the Queen Conk Lab does throughout the Caribbean, here are ways that you can contact us or stay in touch. And for more information, you can visit our website and you also have the opportunity to help support this effort by providing support through Save the Queen of the Sea. Thank you so much. I really enjoyed having this opportunity to tell you more about the eConk online program for growing Queen Kong.